We're down here in beautiful Myrtle Beach, South Carolina, right here on Ocean Boulevard, and we're gonna bring you Cheap Eats. Hey y'all, hey, it's Beaching with the Boons. And normally we bring you restaurant reviews, what's new on the boulevard, what's new in Myrtle Beach. Well, today we're gonna bring you Cheap Eats. And what I mean by Cheap Eats is affordable dining for the whole entire family whenever you come down here to Ocean Boulevard. Before we get started, I'd like to thank all of our subscribers who pushed us to 8,000. Our next goal is 10,000 subscribers. And if you're new to this channel, make sure you subscribe so you can keep up with what's going on around the beach and other adventures that we will bring you. Could have never done it without you. Thank you. Alrighty, so just to get this affordable eats video started, we've walked all the way from Ripley's Aquarium right down here to the Sky Wheel. And so our first stop is gonna be Myrtle Beach Fries. Let's go dig in. Myrtle Beach Fries is located right here across from Sugarland. I love sugar. I don't think it's Sugarland, but it's I love sugar. Myrtle Beach Fries, famous since 1983. So their fresh cut fries are regular $5.95, medium $8.95. For a tub is $11.95. And you can add cheese to any size for $1.95. And they have very limited seating, so this will be one of the handheld items that you'll have to do. And make sure you have cash on you because this is a only a cash only little area. So this is Myrtle Beach fresh cut fries. We added salt and, and a little bit of vinegar. But now it smells like fair fries. Let's see. Is mm. it good? Yes, most definitely. Just look at that good, fresh cut. Can't go wrong with french fries. That's right. All right, so how do they taste? They're good and crispy. They do have skin on them. So I don't know if some of you like the skin on your french fries or the skin off. Comment below if you like skin on or skin off of your fries. But they're good and hot and very crispy. I like crispy french fries, not lumpy. Reminds you of the fair? Soggy, it does. And this is at the Myrtle Beach Fries, right on the corner, right across from I Love Sugar and Zombie Zone. And they had a lot more coming out of the window there. They had corn dogs, looked like chicken fingers and everything. You know, it looked delicious, didn't it? Well, as you can tell, we found a little shade to bring this to you. So we're gonna eat our French fries and people watch. And then we'll go to our next food destination. Yeah, I said we were gonna walk around and eat it, but we're not those type of people that are, we can't function like that. <laughs> so what she's saying is we can't walk and eat at the same time, we'll trip and fall. Whew, that was good. And we got several more things to show you. What you wanna try next? Um, I don't know. I've heard a lot about this New York style pizza. What about that? Right here in Myrtle Beach. But That's on our right. way down, there is, Mad Myrtle's Ice Creamery. Oh, wow, look at that. Let's go in there and take a look and show them around. What kid doesn't like ice cream? Look at this, they got s'mores, they got shakes. Oh my goodness, they even have my favorite cotton candy, rainbow sherbet, yummy. And all kind of toppings too. Wow, look at that, sloppy doughs back in the day. Foot long hot dogs. Look at the pavilion. That's what it looked like back in the 50s, 60s. And they also have a small seating area. So if those kids are clumsy and can't eat that ice cream fast enough like me, they have an area they can sit in. And right next door to it is a high five coffee bar. So parents can get coffee while the kids eat ice cream. Now that's smart. 
And for those of you that are looking for a little more healthier choices, the High Five Coffee Bar has croissants and everything. And New York style pizza, or what is the name of it? New York Pizza Kitchen. Okay, New York Pizza Kitchen. Family dining. Is it eating? So let's go get a slice of pizza. French fries, hot dogs, hot wings, euros, funnel cakes, and bagels and coffee in here too. Wow. So we just put our order in? Okay, we want a slice of your, um, what is that? The Supreme Pizza. A Supreme Slice? Yes, please. So inside is all New York memorabilia. And here's the Supreme with onions, peppers, pepperoni, and sausage. Mm -hmm. And this was 416 beatbox? Yes, ma'am. That's pretty affordable to me. Let's... Tell them what you're going to put on it. And I love this stuff. I call it chipmunk sauce, but. Chipmunk, chipmunk food? Mm -hmm. Here's beatbox. Mm. Now it's my turn. And I'm going to take off some from the side where the pepper's on it. All right. All right, so we're going to split this in two. It was so it is, big. Yeah. There we go. All right. This was 416. That's pretty 416, good. 416, I think so. Tonight I will more. say it's good and crispy. Yes, I like it. It's thin, cheesy. I love onions. Somebody liked it. Okay, we just got Ooh. out of there. How'd you like that pizza? Oh man, that was delicious. That was very good. And I think that's cheap eats. What do you think? I think it's real good. Delicious pizza. Um, yes, it was very delicious. And they, I think that's affordable, cheap eats, don't you? Right. And all along here, you can get things like hot dogs and salads. Ooh, look, they have a Greek salad. I can't eat one of those right now, but we'll definitely come back and check it out. Right. They do have funnel cakes right there. So now this is, um, Easy Eats Cafe. What do they have? Okay, they have funnel cakes, um, deep fried funnel cakes. They have milkshakes, strawberries. They have a Greek salad at the Easy Eats Cafe, which I would love one of those. I'll have to come back and try that. So here's your old time photo, but you wanted some. I do want some kettle corn. What is corn. this, kettle corn? Yes, it smells so good. I think I can walk and eat that at the same time. And we're getting kettle corn inside the old time photo. Well, some people are waiting to get their pictures made. <laughs> so you can get lemonade and popcorn combo for $12. So what'd you get? Oh, yummy. Some good old kettle corn. Now, Let's is that see. regular? Yeah. I thought you were going to get like a flavor. I was going to get the caramel, but I decided, you, you know. You want a regular kettle yeah. corn? Mm. <laughs> oh, my Lord. You about mm, spill you that. Smell Let's Let me hold your water. There we go. Mm. Good? Yeah, that's good. You know what? You can walk and eat at the same time. <laughs> I doubt that. <laughs> so that was at the old timey photo. So if you're looking for something sweet and salty, this is the thing. So that was sweet and salty? Yes. Just, just like, like you? Yes, with a little bit of hot sauce. Well, I'm thinking something sweet. How about that funnel cake? Funnel cake it is. Off to the funnel cakes. <laughs> All right, so we're going to get our funnel cake. We're at Burger Paradise. At Burger Paradise. And so here you go. You got Burger's Paradise. It's the Paradise Burger. Pizzas and funnel cakes again. That's right. And to give you an idea of what the prices look like. Mm, look at those delicious looking french fries. You got a cheeseburger for $8.99. Bacon cheeseburger for $9.99. Double cheeseburger for $10.99 and so forth. Dang. Well, that moment you've all been waiting for. The funnel cake and woo wee. If you could just smell, it smells like cinnamon powder and this is definitely gonna be a watermelon sugar high. Let's see here, what you got? Mm. Tell me how it tastes. Okay. Mm. My piece. Mm. Mm. That's Crunchy, good. it is. It's very good. It's thin and crispy. And, uh, oh man. And sugary. Delicious. So this sugar concoction <laughs> is six dollars. That's not bad for a funnel cake. And it will probably feed about three of you. After this, where you want to go? I'm thinking corn dog. Corn dog? Yeah. So if you saw the Gatlinburg 
video. The kids wouldn't let me get one of those large corn dogs from Sparkle Fanny's. So I'm going in here to Peach's Corner and I'm going to get me one. Peach's Corner. Peach's Corner since 1937. And guess what they have in here? Everything. Yummy. So you so finally got you a corn I dog. I finally got my corn dog. And oh my goodness, smell it. It is, smells so good here at Gopi Box. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Look how fat. Mm. <laughs> Let me see. Good gosh, it covers the whole bread. Delicious. Yeah. Delicious. That's sweet. That yeah, sweet. and look, you can sit here and have you a hot dog or corn dog, like my favorite, a drink, and just people watch. What better way to do that? And if you're out there on the beach and you get hungry, come in here and get you something to eat or a nice cold one. Hey, how are you hey, doing? It's you Beaching doing? with the Poon. So I heard that you ate a corn dog. How long ago? Uh, not a corn dog, a foot long uh, in uh, 1945. In 1945, he was yes. here, here I was, eating. I was here, I was seven years old, our first trip to the beach, and it would have been either on uh, a Monday or a Tuesday, because by the time here on Saturday, we didn't come in the town then. But uh, my first footlong hot dog, I ate it all by myself. Oh my goodness, yes. it was bigger than you, huh? Yes, it was. And it's, it's it, a, what are you really getting? Was. I'm sit right beside you. So what are you getting today? Foot long hot dog. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that is awesome. I can't wait. Hey. The, the two sweetest ladies that will serve it up right. <laughs> Well, there you have it. I'm sure that it was a lot cheaper back then than it was today. But there, this concludes our Cheap Eats on the Ocean Boulevard. Hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Ring that bell notification so you too can keep eating. Hey, and when's downtime in Myrtle Beach? <laughs> Obviously not yet. Well, that was a fun video. It sure was. Yeah, the kids are going to get us about eating all those sweets. <laughs> Heck yeah. I didn't see any broccoli on there on the, on the boulevard. But that's cheap eats and that's good. Hold well, on. you know what? There was so much food to decide. And yeah, it may look like that we got some fried foods and good old greasy foods. But you know what? I'd like to come back and try the gyros and the Greek salad and all that. We're, we can do that. Yeah, because you know, after eating all those sweets, we're going to have to go on a diet soon. <laughs>